What's that? Oh, sorry about that. There's a phone call in the background. Um, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Hello, I am Kermit the Frog, and today we are going to take part in round night in my very first season as a team principal for our Formula One team, which, um, for some crazy reason I decided to partake in whilst I am on my sabbatical in my pop career. And, uh, at the moment, where am I in the standings at the moment? My, as a team, we are standing in fourth place. And as a, as a, by myself, I'm in third place. The fastest froggy flying around the circuit. Anybody that watched last week at the beautiful, beautiful south of France before I uh, made the lovely trip back to Disneyland Paris, I managed to win in France. I came in first place after the disaster in Montreal. I managed to win. I managed to beat my rivals in the evil Lewis Hamilton and the other evil Max Verstappen. And thankfully I won. Oh, have I won. Now, let's see where I can do now before between now and my next race in Austria. The beautiful Austria where the hills come alive with a sound of music. What can I do with? Well, it's always nice to promote myself. And, uh, always nice, nice to help out Louis. Now, where did he finish in the last race? Our oh, poor Louis. 19th. Hmm. Not that much improvement, but at least he's better than he did in Canada. But, uh, not as... On top of the world, as you might have felt when we were in Imola, in beautiful, beautiful Italy. Finally, something that worked in R&D. We're able to attract a new sponsor to the team. Head on over to the corporate tab. Yeah, yeah, we got more corporate sponsors. Don't you worry, don't you worry, my friend Charlie. We got all the money we possibly need. And hope for our team to get a lot better and uh, improve, you know, the rest of our R&D. And, uh, should my best friend Louis Deltras no longer want to race for my froggy flying froggy team, then, uh, I'm sure there's somebody else waiting in the wings. Well, I suppose the best thing to do is just to get straight on the track and, uh, get the first session on. Are you kidding me? Rain in the race? Rain in first practice? Oh, come on. I thought this was lovely and sunny in the Austrian summer. Obviously, you guys have lied to me. I don't know. Maybe I, instead I should take part in, uh, Formula E instead, where you know, Saudi Arabia is lovely and sunny all year round. Hmm. Decisions. Decisions. We're going to be logging some extra data during this session. Nothing you need to worry about, but as we have some new parts, we'll just confirm they're performing to spec. Hmm. Let's do some uh, tire management first. Oh, oh. Look at fuel management. Nah, I don't care about reading program, anymore. I just want to go real fast. Saving technique: lift and coast through corner entry to save as much as you can while keeping under the minimum lap time. Easy done, Jeff. Don't you worry about a little thing. It's gonna absolutely pace it on these corners. Yeah, they be epic each time. Maybe I could come around that corner though, just a teeny tiny little bit faster. And maybe I kind of just uh, hit that apex a little better.
here. Next factory incomplete. Okay, test complete, and that was a very good job indeed. We got a lot of valuable information out of that. Yep, that's the winner of the way. It'll do. Okie dokie, which one is next? There's four laps of fuel remaining. Jeff, you don't have to remind me whilst I'm in the pits how much fuel I have remaining. Maybe you should use those lips and uh, put that over on a mug and sip some tea instead, rather than flapping around for no reason. So uh, chill your beans, buddy! I suppose the best thing I can do right now is uh, get a really, really fast time. Give us some Duh. consistent laps, please. We're looking for good data that we can work into the race strategy. Oh, that was rubbish burning. Who's this it did in front of me? Expecting rain in around 10 to 15 minutes. Hmm. Let's get back to the garage and hopefully we'll have enough time to do that again. Something tells me next time I should not be Car so eager. Have set us back a little. Okay, it's cool again. Sorry, Jeff. Uh, well, at least we got lots of fuel, right? Oh, you don't need a fire on these corners. Three laps before the ring comes in, that's all I need. We get a bit of time that's better than uh, the best new fiddle. That was too slow. No, I know that was a little bit too slow around that corner. I mean, to achieve a. try to achieve a time of 1 minute 11, I must have to be a complete and utter novice at this Formula 1 game. I uh, do think I haven't driven in my life before either. Great lap. You've nailed what we asked for. Keep it up. First place is not bad either. Well, it looks like the evil Max Verstappen has managed to claw his way into second place. I just looked over took him on the outside. Nah, 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 nah. Aww. Look at that over took him before he went over the pits. Okay, super job so far. We're getting great data. Stay focused. 
caught in a correction spin. Let's see what you mean now. But uh, unfortunately, I have to do the right thing and get past you. Whee! Bye! Oops. Hamilton, do the right thing! Do the right thing, Hamilton! Oh man, like Hamilton wants to race on a set on a Friday morning, eh? Yeah, well, look at him. My car still works. Great lap. You've nailed what we asked for. Keep it up. Can't believe you do that to me. We've had to spend time in the damage to the car. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Come on, get it over and over with, please. That'll do. Oh! Hmm. I don't like the look of those little okay, cows. Okay, your goal is to get through as many corner gates as quickly and precisely as possible. Remember to activate your DRS in the DRS zone as well. DRS zone is coming up. Get ready to open it. Distance is on your MFD. Oh, I can see my best friend Louis Delatraz being overtaken. On um, practice day. Early on a Friday morning. Looking good. Now let's try for purple. You'll get a bonus for consistency if you can chain good corners together. Mm, let's push it to try it again. Give me a Louis Teltras. I mean, I thought we would, thought we were the best of friends. Trust me to miss one key. Hmm. I think that should do nicely. 
Great stuff. You've pretty much nailed this circuit. This is a really strong foundation to build from over the weekend. Yep, indeed. Thank you. Oh, well, something tells me I should increase my top speed a little bit and go out on the softs instead. Typical! Rain is going to keep getting heavier for the next 15 minutes at least. One minute, one minute is all I need. Thank you very much. Program Bye -bye. complete and a job well done. We got some excellent data with that run, so come on back to the garage and I can talk you through the numbers. I suppose I'll do for now. Hopefully I should still finish on top of this practice session. So close though. I'm just glad I didn't have to do it in the rain. Or, or rather, I'm just glad that I didn't have to change into the intermediate tires. The session has drawn to a close, so let's review our top three. Green, Bottas, and Lewis Hamilton. Sadly, it's... Yep, you're welcome. Well, on to the next one, I suppose. No, I really don't want to go on the hard tires. All I really want to do is uh, go on the soft tires instead.
Hmm. Nope. That is one way of absolutely tanking a lap. Let's just tell the rear tires to uh, slow down and calm down a little bit. Now let's try it again. Thank you, Mr. Louie, for giving me such a very good toe. And then I go and do something stupid like that. I'm gonna really do the right thing now. Let's try it again at some point. Let's uh, change the car settings a little bit. We get a bit more sleeker around the corners. I mean, how is it possible in one morning that uh, I'm not my that this beautiful green car of mine drives like a box? have set us back a little. That's fine, I'll live. And get a faster lap. Much faster lap than the previous one.
idiot! You absolutely idiot! Battle! But because I am a time traveling froggy as well, I'm willing to give you the benefit of the doubt. I swear this track is not like me. We've had to spend time repairing the damage to the car. Let's see what I can do about the fuel load in my car. Yep, something like that. Let's try again, folks. Mm, it definitely, definitely would be a very sad little froggy fight with no need to uh, finish his practice session in first place. Why is it when I go down around these corners? There's another car, it looks like it's gonna be in my way. I must say, viewers, this has been the qualifying session. Nope, no, he hasn't. This has been the practice session from hell. Car repairs have set us back a little. Hmm. All I wanted to do was Lando's first. How did Lando get first place? Well, I can't really live on this anymore. I need um, number one. Don't get me outdone by a child in an orange car.
There's four laps of fuel remaining. Hooray! First fastest lap! Now do just a slight little improvement from the last one. And I'm going back in the garage and hopefully nobody else will overtake that time and I can rest and I have lots of clips to and I can have a rest and I can handle the amount of this to realize the practice session for oh! Alpha! It's time to remind ourselves of our top three. Who are? Green. Good day today. Let's have your take on it. You really went all out in practice today. Are you testing new components? Have any comments about this team? You left a lot of paint on the walls today. Were you struggling for grip or did you just misjudge some corners? Great. Well, that's everything. I quite frankly don't know what you're talking about. You didn't hit any walls at all. I hit other drivers who oh, got in my way. Plus, I was doing really fast laps. Confound this circuit sometimes. One time. That's all I want to do. is just achieve one decent lap where I will be the fastest in the practice session without crashing my car into other cars.
Hopefully I've pushed this car to the limit and get a really decent time. Why well, wasn't that time to well, wasn't I doing time stuff yesterday? This is such a much better day today. I broke one minute six. Come on, come on, have a go. We think you're hard enough, Max and Lewis. Nope, can't reach me. Can't reach me at all. Roar, you butt ass. Still standing pretty high up here. And with all the cars now over the line, let's see our top three again. I suppose this is something I've never realized before. All these apply to get cheaper parts. Let's see what R&D can do for me now. Well, I still have to wait a week for one thing. Well, let's do you. And let's... One! Well, at least it'll be ready for the next Grand Prix. Along with hopefully a lot of other parts. Let's go qualifying! No, is this really the setup that I want? Pretty sure it is. Hmm. Let's just go. The worst thing can happen. Other than being... Other than being... Be Lap. That's all we want is a decent lap. Let's see if I can break one minute five today. By uh, exceeding track limits and also cutting corners. Oops. And also forgetting how to break. Silly me.
Let's try it again. That was the fastest lap. There's only one lap of fuel remaining. Yep, that's all I need. That is all I only need to. Nobody on this on this green panther is gonna come with anything. Sniff of my time. Yes, this still makes me that. Yep, still me, still fastest now. Let's see, how did my friend Louie do? Last but one! It's not like I even give you a slow car. Maybe it's the, the driver that's completely and utterly slow. Quite unfortunate, really. Same thing again, I suppose. If I really have to end this in quick place, then so be it. Not bad, eh? Yeah, but thing is like...
That's the fastest lap so far. Well done. Just what I need. I mean, when you are one and a half seconds ahead of your nearest rivals, I think it is time to uh, ready for Q3. Always, always some kind of fall in my car. You would think uh, there was some, uh, some little toaster or somebody decided to uh, chimney rig the uh, wires. We've got a situation at the moment. Seems like something's off with the fuel injection system. Little repair nubby when I drive on the track. You better turn my car into a faulty toaster. I don't want to be a cocky little frog in this car. I want to be able to drive very really fast as well. We have two laps of fuel remaining. All we need. Just put in the fast minute this five. Lap. Good job. Yippee. Oh, take that first step in. Take that Hamilton. It's not you guys or you butters. It's not you that'll be pole position. It'll be me, the little green froggy. Take that, you pair of do gooding roustabouts. Who think they're better on this race track than little me? And with qualifying complete, let's review our top three today. Green, Ricardo, and Lewis Hamilton. Goodbye for now. And all of you will not be on the podium with me.
Right. I think we can call that a successful qualifying. We should yeah, be me too. Hopefully the weather won't weather won't be too bad today. Hopefully it'll start off as rainy, but then as the session goes fast goes by, then uh nice sunshiny weather. You know. Last three laps. Man, it's Welcome a to the bog. beautiful Styrian Mountains for another chat off the back of a fant After the points finish last race, let's aim to keep the momentum going. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Drive through penalty. Oops. Didn't see it. And away we go! No you don't, I'm keeping my lead, thank you! Easy does it now, easy does it. work that's a new fastest lap of the race yeah for now but uh hopefully in this next level he won't be slipping and sliding like a, a little froggy off skates on a little racetrack
gap to teammate behind is 17.5 seconds. Pretty can't be having Lewis Hamilton go press his lap every time he crosses that line. Now give me the best slap, will you? That was the fastest lap of the race. Keep this up. Well, I should hope so with the uh, number 14 left to go. I'll do. Not the fastest lap. Good job. That was the fastest lap of the race so far. Are you alright? Engine off, engine off. Mm, why did I crash like that? Again, try and trap and frog. Sorry, Lewis Hamilton, but you do There's not have my power. Incident on track, but officials aren't looking to push for a safety car right now. Just be careful. Hmm. It doesn't look any of our beloved colleagues has crashed out of the race.
Come on, little Frocky. 11 left to go in the swamp like conditions. I can do this. Get two wins in a row. Hopefully get back to the top of the leaderboard. And uh, show that good for nothing Bartas who's really We're a top of our teammate by 36.0 seconds. So sometimes I can't hit this car. It's like a box without... A, it's like a box sled. Except that we are not on ice, but we are on a very wet track instead. Radar suggests that this heavy rain will be with us for a while now. Yeah, gee, thanks, Jeff. You really are the uh, bringer of good news. You only bring me more good news when I've won this race, Jeff. And once you maybe another cup of tea with a lot of biscuits. Thank you! But uh, whatever you do, don't do not give any of those biscuits to my good friend Louis Deltrez. And I have a feeling that he'll try to drop them, just like he has been dropping the ball all season so far. Uh, I suppose we are a work in progress team. I can't, ex I can't expect this team to work miracles, except for myself, because it is my team after all. Do you think once I reach the finish line, I should wait and let my good friend Lily cross the line in front of me? Leave a comment in the section below. Don't tell me if I should be a really good teammate. Or should I really think, yep, yeah, it's all about me? Okay, seven laps to go. Okay, I feel there's eight laps to go. There. Those laps are gonna go flying as long as I don't.
Hmm, the order of this race really isn't changing much. And, uh, quite frankly, I don't, do not think there's anything I can do about it. I mean, if both of Mercedes started to crash, then, uh, both of Red Bulls, except for my favorite, and everybody's favorite Mexican Checo, decides to crash, then, uh, everything will be just, uh, lucky dory on this track, on this day. You know, that'll teach me to do a little bit of sightseeing. Okay, we're monitoring somewhere on the ICE. Be aware that we will start to see a loss of power. Now you tell me, 14 laps into a race, I'm leading, my car isn't breaking, I'm not crashing into any of the other cars, and now you tell me I'm losing power. Ah, uh, Jeff, you're, you're, yeah, you're really something, you know. Just like Louis, I thought we were friends. At least tell me after the race, this car's losing a little bit of power. Oh, look ahead! Somebody to overtake! I'm gonna be overlapping on. Oh, the other race! Oh, jeez. Louis, you already have to be the first car I have to overtake. Everybody's really is going for a bad person situation but I don't think we have cause to move on to a different tire yet no me neither let's just stay out who needs I don't think we need a pit at all I think our friend Louie here can at least give us a little bit of a toll if he can't do any can't do anything in this race. Oops. Thanks, bro.
Fine, Louis. All right, all right, I suppose at least you only have to do one more lap in this race. What else are you doing? Five fuel remaining. And I don't even need to use it all. Okay, who next on this track? Look at this, I mean look! Not only is it one car, but there's four! If I can just keep this car straight. Well, thank goodness for that. Who's next? Surely there has to be somebody else that I can overtake on the last lap. And quite frankly, it'd be really sad if there wasn't. Laps of fuel remaining. That's right, you can put it in my road car. We can uh, drive through the hotel after this race. Because after a very horrible second practice session, but when every other session I got the fastest time, I managed to clean through qualifying. Very much slithered through practice. And for the second time in a row, in a two week, two times, two weeks, I win! That's a I race win! win and your second race win in a row. Thank Fantastic you, Jeff. Job. I know, right? Oh, thank goodness for that. Oh, such a great feeling winning two in a row. And hopefully, be even further up the championship. Smiling faces on the pit wall after a superb I just wish, really, really wish. So my best friend Louis, I don't think performed better today. Right but uh, hey, at least you got a shoe. I get a shoey today. Sure. I get a trigger shoey. My first ever shoey. Thanks, Danny Rick. My favorite driver to do a shoey on a podium with. After an incredible performance, Lewis Hamilton secures the top spot in the Drivers' Championship. Now, for let's now. discuss, Ant, who would you say is a contender for Only 40 for points the behind you, Lewis. Gets my vote today. Only it's time to check out the constructors' standings. Only takes one, Mercedes ruining your chances of winning the, your After home Grand Prix. Like that, who knows what the and believe me, I would love to ruin your chances of ru winning the your home Grand Prix. And then I'll be on, back on top of the world, baby! Amazing performance out there. I'm sure you're pretty happy with that. 
Yeah, slightly ecstatic. You're beating all expectations. Would you say we all underestimated you? There's quite a buzz around this team at the moment. What are your thoughts on them? How do you feel the weather affected the outcome today? Appreciate your time. Thanks, Claire. I suppose interesting questions deserve, deserve interesting answers. You poor thing, but uh, but yes. Well, frankly, that's what I'm talking about. Team's income is looking very robust right now. It's time for you to have a think about our profit margin and what areas of the operation might benefit God. from that money. Feel the gain. Hmm. I think it's time to upgrade the, my departments. And uh, that is it for another session of Kermit Team Racing and Kermit the Frog in my very first season as a Formula 1 principal. Next week, I'm off to Silverstone, baby! My favorite track in the whole wide world! Yay! So, uh, thank you very much for sitting along for the ride whilst I win my fifth race of the season. And hopefully, I will make it six. But until then, 